you enter this match preparing very well using uh, in the best possible way time uh, of two weeks of FIFA break, players that uh, have played with national teams, Bafana, Bafana, Zimbabwe and Zambia have gone. The uh, rest of the players have worked very hard. When they came back, we reintegrated them, prepared very well for this match, uh, analyzing the deepest possible details, uh, working on certain things that they have been missing factor with us in matches behind, six matches that we played in August. In that regard, I would just say that um, uh, we had, I like to, to combine it, that document is not valid if it has not stamp and signature. In other words, I would like to say that we have in all six matches, we played very well. We wrote the document. However, signature and stamp was not there. Today, we went with an intention to uh, write the document, to play good football, to uh, sign the document, to n protect our goal, and to put the stamp scoring the goal and goals in order to win the game. Uh, players have done very well in order to prepare every single detail. Uh, we started uh, very well, dominating that possession, limiting the opponent in counter-attacks, uh, having some uh, balls that uh, we have allowed opponent to come to us, however, scoring in right time, finishing the first half. On half time, correcting what was supposed to be corrected. We went then uh, in second half with an intention to kill off the game. However, uh, we considered that goal that uh, changed the complexion of the game. And later on, opponent came at us. We had that uh, blackout, I want to call it, when we considered the goal and that chance one-on-one, -on -one, uh, where Lady Luck followed us, uh, having in mind that we have worked Luck to follow us. Luck is following courageous people and courageous players, our team this uh, today. Then when it was 1-1, one, one, we have gone to plan B, putting uh, all in attack. I need to give credit to the players coming and impacting the game. From then on, we scored those two goals. We could score even fourth and, and wrap the game in the best possible way. Uh, hard game against very good opposition, very good opponent team, finalist of the MTN Super 8 team that has in past uh, given us so much problem. Last time we, we lost on penalties and missed the penalty uh, in order to win. Today it was on our side. Uh, good is that this was our first win here at Orlando Stadium. Uh, good is that on wings of confidence of this uh, win today we want to correct what is wrong and uh, keep up what was good in order to go into the next set of matches that we are having starting with uh, Cape Town City on Wednesday. The game, it wasn't an easy game. We were playing against the great opponents, but I reckon the technical team did a great job. They've been having sleepless nights, preparing us, planning, analyzing the opponents, so it paid dividends. And the team pulled through, gave everything that we had. Yes, it was a slip of the moment when we considered the goal, but I'm happy that we managed to come back and score two goals and win the game. Uh, first of all, you need to know that they know us very well, we know them very well. What happened in that second half, we had the problem because as you could see, uh, Rusike was stretching Nyauza on the right, uh, Lake was stretching uh, Maela here, and they have left uh, one on one, uh, practically central, they have left uh, very good in holding the ball, uh, Grobler, on Happy Jelle. Uh, in that regard, uh, we had transformation of Mokoena, transformation of Yeye, and others. So, uh, we were looking to not be that much stretched, and this was a uh, time of the game where we have been in a uh, downslide of our performance. So in a way we wanted to strengthen that so that, that, that we are not overstretched over the field and transformation comes uh, from uh, Modiba on the left especially. 
from Yeye, from Okoena. So it was three on three, and then transformation comes. Then uh, there exactly Flick comes, second ball comes, and uh, uh, Colam Lambo and Motswari did very good job in order to protect and also themselves they have been. So addition of Topola made uh, a bit job easier, giving us numerical advantage there behind and giving that numerical advantage help us in a way. However, we have not uh, respected that one ball that came, we considered a goal, and then from that situation, uh, we went with two attacking players, we showed the character, we have never nervous, we have believed in the uh, uh, football we are playing, we, we knew that something will come our way, and I give the credit to the players for the character shown. Uh, never say die, never give up, and this is exactly what paid us dividends, the way Colm Lambo told, uh, and we won the game. Talking about the pass, uh, I think I saw Tembinko Siloj, and we have a bit of an understanding with him, because I played with him at uh, Cape Town All-Stars, so I, I can read his movements and he can anticipate my passes, so it, it makes everyone's job easier and the teammates around us, everyone, we slowly and slowly coming correctly with the combinations, it, it will show up as time goes by. It's not something that we, it will just happen in the sleep of a moment, but it needs time, it's a process. When we talk about the love letter, uh, we need to tell you that it's very hard uh, in presence of the, pub of the spectators uh, under the heat of the match to deliver the right information. So we are having uh, some players that are backbone of the team, including here Colm Lambo, that fully understand uh, what is supposed to be done. So to them, uh, it has been delivered a uh, message we are, uh, that you are calling it love letter, uh, that has later on been implemented and it looked like it worked and it will work in times ahead of us. With the highest degree of respect to you, uh, when you look the character of defenders that he has played, Clayton Daniels and Bongani Kumalo, uh, they are masters when you are statical. They will defend on you because of physical presence and whatever. But when you pull them out, when they go to mark, you practically provide the space behind that could be exploited in the best way. And this was exactly intention. Uh, we are playing in football where we want to do anything possible to drag the opponent to come out of their play, usual pay, playing positions in order to provide space behind or to go with them and then to provide space in so-called uh, golden zone in front of the defense. So uh, this was the instruction he has done, as per instruction, and he will still do because we, can, uh, we are not playing traditional football with static uh, target man, but we, uh, with the players we are having, we look every single player to squeeze out like lemon last uh, drop uh, of the best football from each player. With the highest degree of respect to coach Benny McCarthy that has a wonderful team and that has proven themselves by ejecting sundowns, by reaching the finals. Uh, and when you have that in mind, we know that we are playing with one competitive team that want in the best possible way to use the matches ahead of us before playing finals with the super sport. Uh, Practically, fixtures wanted that we are playing two finalists of the MTN Super 8. Uh, they want to use these matches in the best way in order to gain, uh, to gain the competitive form that will lead them to go all out uh, in, on the finals in Durban. In that regard, we know what uh, threat we are having. They know us, we know them, we know the details will decide. We want uh, on the wings of confidence, uh, because confidence in football you can get only when you are winning. All other stories, we have played well, we have done this, we have done that, are not, uh, uh, are not giving confidence enough, only winning is giving. So uh, not carried away by this win, knowing that the way football rewarded us for the hard work of our players, the way football can punch us back, therefore, 
with humility, with full understanding that we need to work very hard, that we need to expose their weaknesses, that we need to close their strong points. We are preparing that match in total peace, as I told, on the wings of today, on the wings of today's. As I told, the uh, reason why we put Topola was that to not, uh, with their uh, arrogantly stretched players, like right, uh, Rusike left, and uh, a Grobler central, to not stretch our last three players, uh, we provided fourth player that is giving us numerical advantage. However, it did not work. We considered that goal from cross that, that exactly came from that side. We were supposed to block that cross because small problem there became big problem when we considered. However, uh, we have worked and we are working and one of the best possible way of team growing is uh, when uh, for every single question that football posed to you on the field of play, you are having certain answer. In case that we came in negative uh, uh, situation like it was, 1-1 one, one was not enough good result for us. We uh, had answer with introducing two attacking players, Lorch and uh, Shonga, that they impacted with fresh legs very well. Without uh, congratulations to the players that they have believed and shown the character without losing the head and starting to pump the balls. We still continue to play our football and our football played us back. We scored those two goals, we could score even fourth. Uh, if Shonga was seeing uh, Pule on this side and uh, happy that this worked. We are looking forward for any question football posed to us to find a right tactical answer. We don't have to lose our head despite the negative results that we get even though we play in some other games. But I mean, we are in a process and we, we've got the tactician in Mr. Rulani Mokwena, we've got Coach Micho here, of which they are working very hard. So we can never disrespect them by changing the way they want us to play with the philosophy and the instructions given us to us. So sometimes football can go either way without the lady luck. I mean, looking at the previous games, we were creating opportunities, but we were not managing to convert them. Fortunately enough, today we managed to score three, even though we missed a lot of chances as well. So it's a process that we are in, and looking at the last season results, it's water under the bridge, to be honest. We just have to focus in each and every game that we play and take it as it come. Whatever that might happen will happen, but I reckon the technical team and the players, we set our own goals, and we're looking forward to working towards them step by step. I want first to use the opportunity to congratulate Colm Lambo on one more top class performance that goes in line with what my brother Rolani mentioned to you that we believe that he is in top three, the best midfielders in the country. And he's showing match by match that he is real backbone of our team. I wish him to keep up continuing performing in the same way, uh, being role model and positive example to others and in the same moment uh, growing in confidence and showing that he's real pillar of the team. On the other side, from our side, I would tell you that when you look at, we have never from match to match made more than three changes. From last match against Black Leopards, one was uh, 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 Gabuza that all of you, you know, I don't need to explain, he was red carded. So we brought in Mulenga and we had Tsikilono Nyauza that has put aside his uh, problems that he, he, he had before and came back into the team. He was one of our best performers in last year. He has come back. He got a chance as a second change. Otherwise, it was inconsistency and we shall still keep up having a team as per uh, form, as per performance, as per need, as per details that uh, and weaknesses that we recognize with the opponent, as per strong points uh, that our players are showing, we shall still keep up with having a technical direction in choosing consistency in regards to first 11. Uh, I would say that uh, all the players that they came, they really added value to the team. 
However, uh, we could not immediately put all of them. Now there is no all the players, new players. Now all of us, we know each other. Uh, he has really uh, fitted well into the system. He's doing very well. And I believe that calling him to the national team is a real merit. He really deserves it. Uh, and in the same moment, I want this to be a good injection of motivation for him because all our, our players have unbelievable room for improvement and space for development. And this is what motivates us as a technical team because we believe that our players are working very hard, want day by day to be better human beings than better players, and this is what is driving force. Uh, without uh, wasting your time, it is very important, but in the same moment, we need to give respect to the opponent. We expect a tough match. We don't want to be carried away with the wins against Black Leopards and, and today against Supersport. This is now far history. It's new ball game in Wednesday. And uh, as we speak now, when we go back, we are getting the today's match. We are doing corrections. We are looking to get better. And this is our target. Instead of putting pressure on our players that we must win next match, we want rather to work on the things that will make us uh, uh, having criteria and standards that will help us winning the match. In that regard, immediately after finishing this, we are going back to the drawing board, preparing for the game against Cape Town City. With all due respect to them.